find the scope if everything is free. I mean, what we decided, matter of fact, if you look at our business plan, the business plan was, um, was designed as a fee-paying school. But then one day I woke up, you know, me being a reverend, I woke up one day and I said, you know what, how am I impacting anyone's life if you're paying for this? So I called my accountant and I said, you know what, unfortunately, this is going to be a free school. And he got mad at me. <coughs> So guys, let's not stay too long. Let's get straight into this. They have this in Ghana. You have this tuition-free trade school that this philanthropist guy built for Ghanaians, but not all the Ghanaians, for Africans in general. As long as you're living in Ghana, you can go to this school, free tuition. They teach. Let's get into the video, and um, it will be it's a great effort by this. Let me not talk anymore. I'm talking too much. Let's get into the video. You've done something that I always thought it's impossible in Ghana. Wow. I mean, a freelancer school? Yeah. yeah. And it's free. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> freelancing that is free. <laughs> <I'm> free. <laughs> no. Tuition free education. That's my brain, right? Yeah, 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 indeed. I'm sorry, are you a Ghanaian? As I am. Were yeah. you born and raised in Ghana? Um, yes, I yeah. spent the formative years of my life in Ghana, but um, I was still as a teenager, and, and then um, I'm back now. And you want to do things for Ghanaians for free? Not only for Ghanaians, the whole of Africa. The whole of Africa? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Look, can we give him a round of applause? Facts. <laughs> just want to know, yeah? You mean, students can come and do this for free? Yes, they can come in and use this place 100% free. For free? For how long? For a whole year. This is the real free <laughs> Stick up in. So you see that this video guys for all Ghanaians. If this school, this building was is in um in Ghana. So it's uh imagine if it's like going to a university for a year without paying. That's basically what this is. So it's a great effort. And they're gonna put the website and how you can get in. Um, but for this year, I think it's full because the deadline on this on this year was the 29th of January. That was like a couple days ago, like a week ago. So it's late, but I can still really suffer the for the coming year. Who knows if they might still have space by the time you see this video. So guys, if you if you're living in Ghana at the moment and you're, once you're an African, you can go to this school for free. So let's continue. <laughs> Uh -huh. At what point did you leave Ghana? I left there when I was 17 years old. And at what point did you decide to come back home? Um, 30 years in the diaspora. Um, I'm back now. Why yeah. did you live in the diaspora for 10 years and yeah. decide to return back mm -hmm. to the motherland? Why would you do that? Um, I need to check. <laughs> I need to check. You guys are going to be so too, right? <laughs> <laughs> Why did you come back? Um, I just came to um, change the trajectory of many people's lives. Uh, you know, I used to come from time to time and go to, um, you know, public schools and teach them um, reading. He's a teacher. Literacy. But this time around, I said I want to do something bigger and better. Something that will be impactful and something that will change people's lives around. Yeah. You know, the, you know, the, there's a saying that when you give someone a fish, right, they'll come back the next day for another fish. Naturally. But when you give someone a boat, they fish for themselves. They'll fish for themselves and feed the whole community. So I decided... I'm sick of I'm sick and tired of giving people fishes. Every time you give me um, uh, um, some, some some cities. So this time I say, you know what, let me empower you, get you an education, then you can go out there not to look for a job, but to start your own business. That's what freelancing is all about. That is what's and how do you intend to achieve this? Intend to achieve it very simply. Open a school like this and get people who cannot afford to pay for the tuition to come in here, school fees free, learn without any disturbances. No one will call you halfway. No head teacher will say, hey, you owe money, and, you know, get out of the class. But rather, just come here in peace and study very hard. It was only a couple of days ago, just about three days ago, and there was a lady who could not pay for her school fees. So my friend was working for money to pay for her, her exam fees, and she was 30 minutes late for her exams. So we had to get some money together real quickly before she could do her exams. But guess what? If you come to Taft College, 
You will never have the problem. How about issue? Yeah, 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 yeah. You need to get approved up and top. Them yeah, said they think top. It's a registered company. Oh, is it? In the Gambia. Oh, wow. And in Jamaica, that's in a um, tough gang uh, record. My, my, my adopted father has got out. Um, stick up in. I am. Um, this video, I took this video from Wade Maya. He's a he's a giant in YouTube in Ghana. And, um, he's one of the big guys uh, doing YouTube in in um in Africa, and the continent. Let's say the continent. I don't want to just put him as a Ghanaian, but and a, he's a Ghanaian, but on the continent of Africa, he's like a, the biggest YouTuber there. So I took this video from there because I saw. I, for me, this is a very interesting thing for Ghanaians and for Africans. As so long as you're living in Ghana, you can go to attend this place with tough college where you can get tuition free all year round. And they're going to show you later down in the video the different, different um, things you can study there. And after you graduate from this, you can go and open your own business and do your own thing. So that's also a plus. So big up to Wade Maya for doing this. Big move. I'm just. I'm, I'm just exposing my subscribers to this for whoever. I have Ghanaian supporters. I have Ghanaian subscribers. So these guys, look at this. Uh, wherever you are, are in the world, if you want to go, if you want to go back to home to Ghana, now is a chance to get free schooling, no intuition, whatever you want to learn. Boom. Let's go. Let's come to you. Wow. Maybe what we could do is we could partner with the top. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we could take this concept to Gambia. Tough gang records in Jamaica. Big ups. So the name of the school is Top College. Top College. Well, what does the T? So it's very simple. T is that. H is um, A is African. And F is freelancers. So the African freelancers. Mm -hmm. College. Top College. Well, tough college. Top College. Top College. Top will get you going. <laughs> what are the programs that I've been offered in Taco? Oh man, we have a plethora of colleges, um, of programs. We start off with graphic design, we have um, classical music production and notation. And then we also have music production, two different courses. So we want the next Mozarts to be coming out of here. We want the um, Hans Zimmers to be coming out of the school. Uh, we have um, digital marketing, we have even auto mechanic you know you know ghana is now um we have so many um assembly plants in ghana yeah, yeah. and it's, it's so sad because we have all these assembly plants coming to ghana but we don't have a very skilled workforce so what we decided to do is get people into this trade so that we can get people straight into work before they even graduate and then we have different courses we have cosmetology um we have um school of fashion design and uh, we have photography, videography, and the list goes on. If you want to find out like, everything about the course, you can go on, a, on our website. Is, 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 is it school that is all about theory or we have the practical? This, this, this is more of a practical page. Boom, that's um, the best. Um, practical is always best. It's not about um, all the theoretical stuff. Okay, because of, and, and where we are going as a, 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 a country or the world in which we're going in, it's not just about what you know, it's also about what you could do. Stick up in, and um, this is also great. So if you're not very skilled in, in written examinations or, or in school, like if you're, dyslex, if you're dyslexic or if you're someone who's very good with your hands, you're a good builder, you're a good Okay, you're a good artist, you can enjoy. I mean, you are, you're a musician, a graphic designer, whatever you want to do in this school, it's possible because you don't need to have an educational background to attend. If cause it's a pract it, they, they do practical work, so it's like hands on, especially in the music, as I say, and the graphic, you have hands on training, so there's no need to be fear. Oh, you're not smart enough, you're not bright enough to go to this. So. It's kind of, I'm, sorry, I'm telling you, this is a big, a, a good look, and this, this college that that is um, tuition free school in Ghana. I'm telling you, it's a big deal. I wish, I wish other countries would like to do this as well. But and also don't forget, he went away for 30 years, and this is what to me. If you travel overseas and leave a country for that amount of years and you you do good for yourself, is it not a bad idea to come back home and spread the the love? with others, help others to help themselves. Not to give them free stuff, but to help them to help themselves. As they say, don't give them a fish, give them a boat, basically. 
So what we decided to do is get people focused on the hands-on education. Because if a lot of people don't want to go to university, what do they do? They still have to be skilled while we're here. So we focus on skills development, and that is what we are doing in Top Cotton. So when you come to our school, do not only learn creativity like fashion design, but you also learn the rudimentary principles of business. So by the time you leave Top College, you will not only be very proficient in your creativity, but you will also become a fully fledged businessman and Woman. Wow! I, I just want to know you invested in all of this by yourself. <laughs> Pretty much, yes, yes. Yeah, you know, um, it's a passion that I have. You know, it's a dream I've always had. I'm a creative director and I just want to change the lives and the creativity um, uh, landscape of Africa. Because people look at us creative people as the, like third class citizens. Yeah, you're right. No one really respects the creatives, but I believe. And this millennium, creatives are the, are, the, are the newest athletes. So we need to teach these creatives how to be very proficient and excellent at their work so they can start making money and they need an opportunity. So we thought this season we will create an opportunity, give them industrial um, machines, and they can go to work. I, 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 this is really mind blowing. Um, you invested in this by yourself. I mean, you have a vision, but yes. your teachers don't have the same vision as you, right? No, matter of fact, I, I, I think the teachers do because we are not just working with, with ordinary teachers. We have the personal lead in this course as a fully fledged fashion designer called Elegant the Tater. Big things to the in that long summer skin thing. What we have done is we have partnered with um, free, um, um, industry professionals and we've also partnered with influencers such as Alicam, Twins Don't Bag, Bahama, who produces Facade Cordier, um, the biggest advertising agency in, in Ghana, and, and, and the list goes on and on. And now, guess what? We have one of mine. He's joining us. You know, if I'm joining us, I don't know. Like, uh, <laughs> Now, guys, I need to invite Maya, right, to become a mentor for our digital media section. How will you be able to find the school if everything is free? I mean, what we decided, my fact, if you look at our business plan, the business plan was um, was designed as a fee-paying school. But then one day I woke up, you know, me being a reverend, I woke up one day and I said, you know what, how am I impacting anyone's life if you're paying for this? So I called my accountant and I said, you know what, unfortunately, this is going to be a free school. And he got mad at me. <laughs> he said, rev, 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 man, you need to go back and pray about it. <laughs> and I said, you know what, I, I thank God the Lord will provide, you know. So we decided to just make a free school and we want to partner with them. Um, donor agencies, um, organizations, you know, if you want to do your corporate social responsibility with us, you can always um, assist I our think, division. I, 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 I need that. to help you out in here. Oh, um, thank you. Stick up in again. So, as I said earlier, I'm imploring Ghanaians, go take advantage of this in your country. It's a big deal. You get, you're not getting any lower grade teachers as you said these are international um designers and, and media people that are coming to tutor the next generation so just want to say that quick and fast take this opportunity grab it by the bull grab, you know, you know the term said grab the bull by the hand and take charge of your life guys it's free no school fees needed just you need to sign up and get in if you have to go on a waiting list do that for the next term but make sure you get in very much. Thank you. Thank you. This is an amazing initiative. Thank you. I mean, with creatives like us, I mean, you know, I established a studio in my in my house okay. just to encourage more people to come and create content for free because 
when I started making YouTube videos, I had nothing. And I know there's so many talent out there who are looking forward to be bigger than even what am I am. But an opportunity. they could win a little bit. Because so I had true. to create for them. But it's so hard to create for so many people. Yeah. So what you've done, I think if you're watching this video and you really want to sponsor a student, please, I mean, reach out to me. No, no, he <laughs> they have to reach out to you. They can't reach out to no, me. No, no, reach out to you. Reach out to me. <laughs> You know, is there a new website? Yes, you can go on our website. There's our website. Stick up in. So, for all my subscribers, especially the Ghanaians who's watching, or if you're overseas and you're new watching, take this website down, phone number, even though just so you can contact the school directly. At and if you want, if you want to send us um, um, a WhatsApp message, give us a call or anything, you can call it on for the Ghana code plus two three three five seven zero zero six six zero 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 six thousand. I think Mastercard Foundation wow. was so much interested in this. Mastercard. Mastercard Foundation. Oh, I, I, I worked with them recently, so I think I'll send them this video. Mastercard, I'm just calling you out in this video. Please. Because uh, that's, that's what they do. do. And um, <laughs> they can actually take care of the whole thing. That, that, oh, oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, behave. I think I'll reach out to them <laughs> on your behalf. Thank you. Thank you very much. Like what is in here? I've got more to show you. Come on, let's go. Still got more to show you. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that a mini office or something? Yeah, a small office. I mean, um, is it a reception or something? Yeah, that's the reception. That's where, um, you know, all the ladies are. I've got, I got beautiful ladies in there. <laughs> <laughs> it's part of the school, yeah, right? It's part of the school, yeah. And what happens in there? In here, it is. Out. So, guys, there is your seat. It's the tough college in Ghana. You get the email just to get the phone number, you can WhatsApp them, you can email them, you can call them, you can visit the location as well. Sign up. So well the sign up finished for this year, guys. As I said earlier, it's since January twenty first, twenty ninth of January, that was like a week ago. Cause today is the seventh. So it's like a week ago. So please, Ghanaians, Africans living in Ghana are next door neighbors if they Possibly can go contact the college guy. This is a big deal. I wish I had this opportunity to do something like this. I would take it, take advantage of it. So please do. And, uh, and that's what I aim to do with my channel to bring things f to the forefront, to spread to the masses so you can learn, grow as I am trying to do the same thing. You don't know. Thanks for watching. Thanks for enjoying. You don't know. It's, you don't know. It's a Washington SXM podcast. I don't know this. Peace. One love. Boom.